So no fundamental uh, cloud certification would be complete without a shared responsibility model. And for the KCNA, they don't actually ask you any questions about a shared responsibility model, which to me is a bit disappointing, but uh, for your own benefit, I thought it was very important that we go find one. And so the cloud native shared responsibility model is a little bit hard to define because uh, you don't have like a large organization defining it and the CNCF isn't defining it. Um, and so what I had to do is find a community members one and then look at it and say, is this good? And I thought, yeah, it's pretty good. And I want to show it to you. So this is the uh, shared responsibility model that I found. It's made by uh, Lachlan uh, White. And I did ask them and say, hey, can I use this model to show off in the course? And they were very happy to say, yes, go for it. And so the idea is a shared responsibility model is the responsibility of the customer or of the team or of the organization for the types of workloads. And so the comparison here is we have traditional IT, hybrid IT, and then cloud native IT. And I know it's really small, but if you look down the list here, we have applications, data, runtime, middleware, OS, virtualization, servers, storage, networking, pretty common for shared responsibility models. Uh, but what's interesting here is who is responsible on the team? And there's a big word here that you'll see that says GitOps. And GitOps can be a little bit hard to define. I have a very practical definition to GitOps, which we'll get into the course, but I just want to emphasize that um, when you're working with cloud native, there is a larger emphasis on GitOps. And so you are seeing things like network engineers, security engineers, solutions architect, SREs, uh, platform engineers, data engineers, and developers. Whereas in the traditional sphere, you used to have like your infrastructure team, your, your middleware team, and then some specialized things. So there's not really much to say here other than I just wanted to point out that there's GitOps. Uh, and that it is uh, core to uh, cloud native. And so that is really all there is to share here, okay?